we will input this value 11.87 okay so we click done and then we go back to the calculation system ipr vlp and then now we will input cases okay cases here and then we select on the variables productivity index this one productivity index okay and the first one the original productivity index is of course five and after fracturing the productivity index is 11.87 or i can paste it here okay so i have productivity index before fracturing and productivity index after fracturing so we can click done and then we can just calculate very fast so here we start with productivity index of five the flow rate is this one 9466 but for the next productivity index after fracturing it's this one we get flow rate of 16644 so from from 9000 to 16000 you can also check plot system plot plot all cases liquid rate IPR VLP, click done here. All right, you get this, the orange IPR before fracturing and the purple IPR after fracturing. Click finish, and then you can also check sensitivity plot here. And variables, liquid rate, click done here. On the vertical axis, I plot liquid rate, and on the horizontal axis, I plot productivity index. So, productivity index of five, and here the next one, eleven point eight seven. You see the product, the liquid rate improves significantly. So, click done, and click done again. All right, so. That's the first case. The first case, we have performed hydraulic fracturing design, which proves that this stimulation can improve the productivity index from previously only five stock tank barrel per day per PSI. And now we can improve up to 11.87, which increase the, 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 the liquid rate significantly. All right, and we will open, okay, uh, you can save, yeah, so save model, you can save, but I will, I will not save, it's okay, and I will open a new case.